two tire air caps are all Ana Maria Echeverria Jimenez has left of her car. It's scary to think that like this could happen now. The UC senior says around 10 Sunday night she was on campus putting air in the tires of her bright blue Mustang. And then I turned around because they had a gun to my neck. She says she surrendered her keys and belongings to the group and ran. It doesn't feel real to say it. Like I couldn't even believe what was happening. This victim asked not to be identified. The UC Junior says she was walking on Warner Street July 5th when she heard footsteps, turned, saw two people and a gun. And they were like a foot or two away from me, but it was pointed at my head. She says she gave over her wallet and keys and took off. I was running down Warner um, screaming for help and so many people were passing by me with their windows down and not stopping to help me. The student I spoke with says that her nightmare of being robbed at gunpoint didn't end here on Warner Street. She says while she ran to her boyfriend's, a group of strangers just a few minutes later pulled up in her driveway. My roommate was actually, actually, her boyfriend saw them go to my house and steal my car. The theft caught on doorbell cam video. This is scary for everyone here. Um, this area is now a hotspot. She says an email about the four gunpoint incidents sent to UC students Tuesday isn't enough. I was pissed because they waited um, over a week to say anything about me. And then it was like three more people after that. So it was like, it kind of felt like it was really late. In Clifton, Meredith Stutz, WLWT News 5.